So, what are the correct doses of vitamin D3 and will it help in weight loss? Okay. So, you want to know the recommended doses of vitamin D3. And weight loss. So, if you want to know that after consuming vitamin D3, whether there, there will be weight loss or not, then answer is yes. There is a lot of journal available which is stating that whoever have consumed 4000 IU vitamin D3 have lost the weight and their muscle density is improved. So, journal is available. So, let's understand correct doses. So, recommended doses are from 400 IU to 600 IU to 800 IU. So, these are recommended. Recommended. Right? So 400 IU is for infants, baby up to 12 months, right? And 600 IU is for or up to 75 years of age. And 800 IU is above 75 years. Is for right? So these are recommended doses. But if you do the blood test or blood reports for vitamin D3. The report will state the normal range from 20 nanogram per ml to 50 nanogram per ml. Right? And the lowest range. Would be 12 nanogram per hour, which is deficit. Means you are, you are having deficiency of vitamin D3. Right? If you want to buy now supplement to maintain the level from this range to this end, right? The, Medical stores will provide you supplement from 1000 IU to 2000 IU and above. This supplement is present in international unit and the report will tell you nanogram per annum. So you need to convert them into this or you need to convert nanogram into the international units right let's take healthy range which is 20 nanogram per ml this 20 nanogram per ml is equal to 0 0.8 IU per ml right and if you convert now, if you do the maths, it will be somewhere like 4000 international unit. Because when we talk about blood reports, normal individuals, blood is 5 liters. Somewhere 5000 ml, right? And if you want to take an average, of total blood that is 
right? So, if you want to understand from this report, which is normal for an individual, 20 nanogram per ml is going to be 4000 international unit. And the recommended are very low. Recommended are very low, right? So you have to make sure if you are taking 1000 IU and if you are looking for weight loss, then you need to increase this IU about 1000 international units. Why? Sometimes what happens? You believe that you are taking this range. The absorption sometimes is going to be a problem. Whenever you will take this range, the absorption will be from 60% to 80%. Right? And if some people do have the gut issue, absorption problems, then this will go from somewhere 40 to 60 percent, right? So even though you take 600 international unit, you will end up getting 400 international unit. As you know now, vitamin D is very crucial in this pandemic because if you are having enough amount the infection infection chances are just two percent infection chances are just two percent right now make sure if you are targeting weight loss you should increase it somewhere like 4000 international unit right i hope i have simplified this thank you very much